What's up? Um, it's precious. It's my nine week post op gastric bypass update. Yeah, nine weeks, and um, just go right into it. No time wasting. Um, highest recorded weight was two eighty two. Surgery weight was two fifty. Last week was two nineteen point eight, and today I am two seventeen point eight, which is amazing because I traveled. Um, Thursday of last week and we were on the road for about 14 or 15 hours. It usually takes 12 to get from Fort Knox to Florida to, um, where we are in Florida. But the weather was so bad that, um, it was raining from Tennessee to Gainesville. And so we had to take our time. We had to pull over actually for about two hours. Anyway, so I did pretty good. I did pack me like some little um, baggies and stuff, of stuff I can eat. My mom, we're at my mom's house and she has some things I can eat. She has Greek yogurt and stuff in the fridge. And my mom does Weight Watchers. So um, I know the things that she has is good as well. Um, so yeah. And let me just say. My mom has been doing Weight Watchers for a long time. She's actually one of those lifetime members. Like when you get down to your goal weight um, and you maintain that or whatever, you don't have to pay for Weight Watchers. So, um, yeah, she's never been big at all. Um, she's just always wanted to be at this particular size. And my mom looks great. She's a beautiful. She's amazing. And she feels like she needs to lose more weight. Anyway, um, with that tangent. I don't have anything else to update you on. I have not worked out or done anything because of the traveling and because we're in Florida. Um, Friday, last Friday, we went to, out to celebrate my husband's birthday. And his birthday is not until Christmas Eve, though. So, but we did that early because no one wants to come out on Christmas Eve. Um, Saturday, we went to my family's Christmas party. Sunday, we went to church and just visited family all day. I mean, we didn't get home last night till really late. And um, today we took the kids to the park and they're outside playing, just enjoying the sun of being in Florida, you know. Um, so, yeah, not much to update you on. Um, I'm actually waiting on my mom to get here because we are going to go and work out. We're going to go to um, the park and this. There's this group of people, They it's free. You just go out and they work out together. And we're going to go do that. I'm going to do that um, today, tomorrow. Yeah, today and tomorrow. They I, I don't know if they're going to do it on Thursday or not. But yeah, so I'm trying to get some workout in. My mom has a pool, so I could get in the water. But um, the way my hair set up, I ain't going to get in the pool. Mm -mm. And I didn't bring no bathing suit. And yeah. Oh, speaking of hair. Somebody asked me if this was my real hair or did I cut my hair? And no, I did not. This is purchased hair um, that I got sold in. So I just wanted something a little different to give my natural hair some a break for a while. Um, yeah, I, I feel like I'm stretching, like I'm trying to pull something to tell you guys. I really have nothing to update you on, which is why I was thinking about and I know a lot of people do this. They change from weekly updates to monthly. But um, it's up to you. Tell me in the comment box below what you want me to do. If you want me to continue to update you weekly, I'm more than willing to do that. I'm, you know, I will do that if you want me to. But if you want me to switch to monthly, then I'll do that as well. It's up to you. Because um, it's just nothing. And then if I have something that is important that I want to tell you, then I'll, I'll make a video for that. But just let me know what you want. It's up to you. Um, other than that, oh, guess what my husband blessed me with? Um, on post, on Fort Knox post. I don't know if it's like all posts or not, but they had they offer this thing called the Biggest Loser, and basically, you you have to pay sixty dollars. So my husband paid that for me. Um, it's a twelve week boot camp sorta where um, you meet with the personal trainer three days a week. I'm going to be meeting Monday, Wednesday, Friday from 9.30 to 10.30 because those are the days that my daughter goes to school. She goes part-time. Um, so you meet with the personal trainer for three days a week 
You also get um, 10, you also get 10 additional like aerobics or workout classes that you can do. They also have nutritional help for you. Plus you get like a Biggest Loser t-shirt. Um, and you, we weigh in on Ju January 4th, we weigh in and then again, April something, I forget the date in April is the final weigh in and whoever loses the most weight gets $500. So yes, I, I joined and yes, I do plan on winning cause I'm very, very competitive. So I will be snatching a $500 and I feel like it's good cause it's strength training, you know? And um, working with a personal trainer, they'll know what I need, what my body needs, what's good for me, what's going to work for me. So I'm excited about that. Um, and tw there's a lot that could change in, in 12 weeks. So I'm very, very, very excited about that. Um, so, yeah, we'll be here in Florida to the 29th, which is not long enough. But my husband has duty on the 31st. Which sucks. Why would they choose my husband to have duty? Um, it's a 24-hour duty. It's AAA duty. He has to sit up in the um, at the desk and do nothing. But just sit there for 24 hours. And that's New Year's Eve. We can't even bring the New Year in with him. That sucks. But what you going to do? The military. They could have chose someone else. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll be at church anyway. But anyway, it sucks. Um, enough of my rant. Um, yeah, there's nothing else, guys. I talked about the biggest loser. I'm down two pounds for the week. Um, I'm in Florida. Um, my husband's birthday is coming up. I try my best to do so much for his birthday because when he was growing up, um, they never separated his birthday from Christmas. They would just be like, you know, get a gift from under the tree. So I make sure I ensure that his gifts are wrapped in birthday paper and not Christmas paper. And every year since we've been together, I pretty much try to either have a dinner for him or like a little um, party or something like that just to make it special for him and no he's never done it for me but that's okay it's always better to give than to receive i hear one of my monks chickens oh and my sister anyway they were outside um i guess they're getting ready to come in so i better end this now um thanks for watching guys i love you guys she's turning off lights and everything Okay. Love you guys. And I'll talk to you guys in another video. Bye.